was gonna let you know I was here. Wow, the truck's back. <laughs> All right, guys. But you got neighbors, so. It's Monday. Joe's truck. Look at that. Is going again. So. Damn. Let's do it. Come on. He's a little empty, Joe. Well, I spent a bunch of time scrubbing carpets, cleaning wood, yep. metal. And seeing as how I had nothing on here, I zeroed out all my inventory and now I'm re-inventorying it. So yeah, there's not a whole lot on here besides having company and family down here. So I at least had something on here. It's a fraction of what I got, but... Well, that looks fun to see all those empty holes up there. But everything up here I got at least inventory done. So, I even had a... Little, let me see. A little video showing it's nighttime, and I'm here hand scrubbing... Wow. You know, but I mean, every, every nook and cranny and so it's a start. So how long has it been since the truck's been uh, down? I Is don't it? even want to tell you that number, but, um, without looking up exact dates, it's over seven months. Oh I think. my goodness. So yeah, it should be, should not be, I know. But anyways, so I got lots of Knipex up here. I'll show you a little evolution of Knipex. I got them all. Do I got them right? It's so going to take you a while to get everything moved from your truck. Oh, from back to this truck. my garage and my other one yeah so here's your original battery cable cutter yep. that's a great tool i mean i i go to junkyards this is where you know they live with those things yep and kinepix came out with the step cut uh -huh. and it'll cut battery cable just as easy nice and can be but i need something a little bit bigger and kinepix saw that and so they come out with the I caught the bigger battery right. cable one, but harnesses. I mean, that guy's it's got a little longer handle than this here. Mm -hmm. um, they just married these two together, and you got the uh, Knipex uh, Frankenfish. But it's evolution. Yeah. And that's what they do. They're, they're engineers. They just keep working, you know, coming out with new stuff, making it better. And even on the backside, you can see... They got these here curved to pull in different directions and with these here curved, right. it, it just bites. It's just like jaws. But, so I got bunches of all them. I have Milwaukee batteries, obviously. I got some Milwaukee stuff. Milwaukee stuff. I heard the horns. Uh, it's not true Milwaukee stuff, but it's Milwaukee stuff. Right. Um, chainsaw, jacket, grease guns. I got a bunch of, I think I'm them, them sell a bim all the way down here, up here, up here, them over here. I got them everywhere. <laughs> um, I got some of my um, sights as far as. Uh, Reflex sights, magnifiers, some of my light lasers, uh, some of my scopes, um, my night vision. Starting to get something in here. Well, I'll be looking uh, forward to seeing it get full again. I am too. Um, I'm forward to running more more than one day too. <laughs> That's right. Um, That'd be my luck. I'd get this damn thing loaded down and quit again. Well, at least I gotta go 
several days in between this and that, but yeah. Well, I know you're glad to have it back. Got to make it easier on you to be able to pull up and let guys walk on here and shop like normal. Yeah. Um, I got several, guys, several shops that haven't even seen this thing at all, ever. So I got power probes. I got stream lights. I got them ratchets on top of the boxes. So I got multiples of those. I got some gear wrench in there. Some stack seam busters. And then I ran out of Knipex uh, over here to stick on the shelf. I got some more here. Um, yep. Gotta love Knipex. Used to have a whole big red area up here. Um, I even found... I even found I, I got some of the Christmas greeting ones. Oh, left. yeah. So, everybody's... There's one that I got kind of open. The only black-handled Knipex for their Christmas edition. Yep. So if you didn't get one last year, you still could get one this year. There you go. Got a couple left. Well, actually I got a bunch left. I just put a few on here. Apparently I ordered a whole bunch. <laughs> I sold a bunch. How long do you think it'll take you to swap everything back over? It depends on how much time on weekends I get. Yep. Um, the thing is, it's it's not just taking and put it on here. It's each each thing is each part number, putting it in. I found a few things I can't find part numbers for. I got to look up. Uh, mm. So I couldn't put them on here right away. Well, um, you get so it figured out. It means every week you get to see something new. That's, <laughs> that's going to be for sure. I got some of the trusty cook hammers. I got the big, them uh, ratcheting. Uh, three quarter. Three quarter ratchet. Of course, I I got the head for it too. And yeah, it's a start. There you go. It's a good start. Well, I'm glad you got your truck back. It's always yeah. Nice to have a tool truck when you're it's, a tool truck salesman, huh? It's it's better than standing outside in back of the pickup when it's really cold <laughs> and rainy and snow and well, we're gonna get some more of that weather. Yep, that's yeah, coming. I feel, I feel bad for the people that got hammered with five feet of snow in New York. Mm -hmm. That's a lot for one time. You ain't kidding. All right, guys. So, well, Joe's truck is finally back, so maybe it'll stay running this time. And uh, Joe will be able to sell some tools there out of the go. truck. That's a good day. So, all right, guys, like always, thanks for hanging out with us. Joe's number is right down here at 731 412 7295. Shoot him an old text message and he'll hook you up with whatever you need. Like always, thanks for hanging out with us. If you like the video, hit that thumbs up. Check over for merchandise, cool tools, and discount codes down here. If you're not subscribed, take your finger, click that button. Y'all have free. a great week. See ya.